Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves out in California, where a frauditor uh, ends up meeting with the wrong person and ends up getting roughed up. But hey, if you're going to act like a complete jackass, you're going to pay the consequences eventually, so let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hello there, welcome to this installment of First Amendment Rights. I'll be checking out some of the local businesses in this industrial part of town, one of the local business parks, seeing if my right to record the public easement curbside will be respected today. Stay tuned, we'll see how things go. Well, for Auditor, we do have our First Amendment rights, but sometimes there are consequences to expressing those rights. And, well, we may be free, but we're not free from consequences of our actions. But please, carry on with your inept stupidity. Are you pissed off at me or the guy with the stone? Pissed off at you for what? I don't know. You're f filming like something you need... You know anything for me? Oh, just checking it out right now. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's never happened before. Someone's never taken pictures and video before? Well, I mean, usually they come in and say, hey, my name's so-and-so and I'm oh. going to be filming. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, you know I'm filming. It's plain as day, pretty much. Yeah, well, what's your interest exactly? Oh, I mean, you, got, you guys are recording too, right? I'm sorry? You guys have cameras mounted For on your building. security purposes, yeah. Oh, okay, it doesn't matter, but you have the right to record, so do I. Okay. Ah, yes, the age-old argument about those security cameras. Well, those dang security cameras are not exactly going to be sold on YouTube for profit, unlike what you're doing here, which will be uploaded to YouTube so you can, well, profit off of it. Yeah, yeah. Kind of bizarre world. Huh? Okay. In a bizarre world? Can I help you? What's your deal? Oh, I'm, I'm good. I don't need any help. Yeah. Yep. Okay, because all the neighbors are calling asking me what's going on. I'm oh, really? trying to find out, yeah. Oh, yeah, just taking pictures and video. I know, but I don't dig it, so you can get the fuck out. Really, seriously, I'm going to call the police, because this is private property. And, I'm aware. And these are people's cars and stuff. And yeah, I, I know. They, they look pretty cool. I was kind of interested looking at all the rusted out Porsche bodies up there. Those are from a fire that occurred here. Oh, wow. And it was a big loss and it's a super emotional deal for me. I'm sorry to hear that. No, no, seriously. Seriously, it was a big fire here. Almost okay. lost everything I ever owned. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm still yeah. recovering from that. Oh, go home with your phony baloney apology, dude. If you were truly sorry, you would walk away right now and forget you ever saw this place because, well, if this guy is recovering from a fire, you might want to just leave that at that and walk away because somebody who's gone through that are going through a lot of emotions about that. So you may want to rethink this. But of course you're not, and you're going to pay the consequences. So please carry on. I don't, I don't, I don't know what you're up to, but I really don't appreciate it. I'm, I'm serious. I'm just shooting some video and pictures. Yeah, I know, all. but you're, you're starting to get on my nerves. I'm telling you right now. I'm standing on a public curbside. I don't care. This is my stuff. I understand that. I'm not on your property. I mean, if you want to be cool with me, I'll share with you. I'll tell you the story. Yeah, People I mean, if you'd like here. to. I yeah. do magazine articles. Very cool. But this is just odd for me to walk up and start taking video at my shop. I don't, I'm not a big fan of it. I mean, I could be a car enthusiast. You could be, and I'm really cool. I have a good rep with it. And I've yeah, been so I mean, tell me to get here. the F out of here and threatening to call the police on me for just I taking pictures. I will call the police if you don't share with me what's going on. I, I technically don't have to. I mean, well, and you if could it, as a human being, as somebody with just being cool. I could. I'm just going about my day. You're going about your day. Yeah. Okay, I mean, whatever you're doing. I like, I like taking pictures in public. Is that okay? Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Well, for Auditor, uh, here's a deal right here. You could always put down the camera and put it away and go look at the cars with him and hear his story if that's what you really want to do. And then later on, ask permission when he's calmed down so he can tell you the story with the camera turned on. That's how you make friends with people. You meet them in the middle and you work things out like that. You don't come at them hard like that because you're bound to make enemies out of them. Oh boy. You do your thing, but seriously, if you're not gone in a little while, I'm gonna ask the police what they can do because 
it just this is uncomfortable for me. You have an interest in those wrecks, okay? So those wrecks belong to people. I understand that. And and they had a great loss, okay? And I was in court for three and a half years over this shit. And I just, okay. okay, so this is super emotional for me, So and I don't know what you're about. Yeah, I can help ease your discomfort if you have any about public photography, that'll explain oh, the loss. Oh, for goodness sake. You're, and, no, and it'll, no, knock yourself out. Okay. I don't know who you are, but knock yourself out. It'll, I would never do this to you. I, I, I mean, I would never like come over to wherever you live well, or do business. Do you live here? Or? I spent a lot of time here. Okay, but it doesn't look like a residence, so I mean, it's... It's not a residence. So saying that you come to my house is, doesn't really compare? Yeah. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass! Such a dumbass! You're an ass! I'm trying to make a, a, a comparison of what you're doing. It's just a little weird. Oh, okay. I'll mm -hmm. let the other occupants know you're just some person that likes to do this, whatever this yeah, is. Yeah, it's called public photography, friend. Have a great day. You as well. Take care. cameras that I uh, pointed out were mounted on his uh, exterior of the building. Well, this uh, frauditor has a real attitude problem, and well, while this guy is gone, he's going to just hang around here for a while, and well, the uh, owner comes back out, and the frauditor still wants to play F around and find out, and well, he finds out the hard way. Hey, don't touch the fucker. You, you, you should leave. You should leave, you should leave right now. Because you're a smart ass piece of shit. You just assaulted me and damaged my camera. Fuck. I was trying to be nice. I got it all on camera. Good. Now, of course, this smart ass likes to talk shit about the cops all the time. But when it comes right down to it, and he really needs them, he calls them because he needs to be rescued from the people that he antagonized. But let's carry on because, well, uh, he fills out paperwork for the next 15 minutes and then complains about the cameras on the building because, well, he wants the security footage, but he doesn't get it. Just got a quick question when you have a moment. Yeah, yes, sir. Um, uh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. sorry. Yeah, yeah, no worries. Um, would he, did he mention if he'd be willing to cooperate with his uh, camera footage? Doesn't want to cooperate. Doesn't want to cooperate. That's no surprise. Okay. All right. Thank you. There we go. The business owner from here did mention make a stink about his security cameras, but when it comes down to it, he's willing to defend his buddy and uh, not present the images there. Well, dude, like I said before, actions have consequences, and if you're going to act like an ass, you're going to get the consequences for that. Should you really be surprised if somebody doesn't want to help you out if, uh, well, you act like that toward them? But at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.